Rome in the building. Rome in the building. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, watch out. What? Watch out, man. Hey, watch out. Watch out. Watch out, man. Hey, yo, yo, yo. What's good, everybody? It's your fave most turned up host, Zodo. We back for a commercial break. Right here on Zodo Radio, bringing you, not me, but you, all your entertainment needs on broadcasthiphop.com. We got the streets, hip hop, and R&B. So I can get into this entertainment report with my girl. All right, let's get into this. Okay, for um the first we have up is the Carters. Okay, so according my baby, my man, Beyonce, <laughs> Jay Z, even Blue Ivy, instead of taking a stand, they decided to sit for the national anthem. What do y'all think about that? I just think that that's <laughs> super dope. Because I don't know if y'all been listening to or like paying attention to like the media lately and like last year everything that happened with like Colin Kaepernick when he was like taking the knee. So that's mm-hmm. kind of like what they're doing in like all the um like football games, Super Bowl games, anything they got to do with like the NFL because mm-hmm. of the way that they treated Kaepernick. Mm-hmm. So they're basically taking a stand to you know not saluting themselves for the national anthem. Mm-hmm. I don't think it's anything wrong, right? Well, according to the well, they got blasted. They got blasted they real bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, on our next report, let's talk about Money Bag Yo and his wife Ari. <laughs> <laughs> well, his girlfriend, his girlfriend, Ari Fletcher, according to the article, they got into a physical fight and he supposedly snatched her wig off and fleeted the scene in his truck. Gee, all what do y'all think about that? All of this happened in Black History Month. So oh, not right now. I always wanted to snatch a lady wig off. <laughs> <laughs> so bad. Just to see, it's like you talking stuff. First of all, uh, in the report, it said something about that allegedly that she had ran after him and hit him, and then she tried to run away and he snatched the wig off. That's something that I do. Mm-hmm. Like, don't hit me and don't think that you just not gonna get, re- uh, get reflection a back. So you get your, you get your wig snatched off. You know what I'm saying? But why, why you got to snatch the wig though? Hey, like, what else he was gonna you could have just what, said that stop. stop. No. He could have just been like, push, he could have just told her, stop, don't do that, move away. Not the wig now. Us women out here, we go crazy about our wig now. That was very embarrassing for a woman. You know what's embarrassing for a man? For them to get hit on by a woman. By no, you're supposed to take that. No, no, no. Take no, do you know no. how bad you get blasted on social media? Man. We're going to take this 2020. Man. We're not going to keep taking y'all stuff. I guess. All right? And I just think that her and her husband <laughs> or her ex-boyfriend, <laughs> I just think that they just had like a little violent weekend, like a little yeah. They probably they probably had a little drink. This or something. past weekend at a celebrity basketball game in Miami, I think it was his baby mama. He ended up snatching her up in public. Oh yes, yeah. yeah. And yeah. he got so much laugh for that. I probably would have did the same thing, but not in public though. But allegedly, what happened? Because I saw that video. Because he snatched her up so bad. Oh, oh no my god. I, I, I can't. I can't tell you what I that think was, that did happen though. What happened? Whoever she was with, you should have seen how they got up and got up. I they saw, he's like, my son like. All right, I'm going to head out like the SpongeBob. <laughs> That's how they got up and got up. You know what I'm saying? Hey, oh man, we got, we got Rome's way in the building. Yeah, Rome in the building. Hey. What's up, my man? What's up, my man? What's up? Ah, hey, I love that shirt on the wall. I need that shirt on the wall. <laughs> Rest in peace all to the old me. Hey. To the old me. Hey, hey. So that's all we got for our entertainment report. After we come back from that, man, we're gonna get into our mental health awareness, mental health Mondays, man. Right here on Zoda Radio, bringing you, not me, but you, all your entertainment needs on broadcasthiphop.com. We got the streets, hip hop, and R&B.